Dun, dun, dun. What's in your Vexilar camera? This is the fish phone. And uh, did I say Uncle L? Dun, 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 Uncle L. And uh, disclaimer, avoid your warranty probably and um, whatnot. So don't open this up. So a big, thick, bulky one to get the three screws off here. Beware, these little blue things are just accents, but they're siliconed in, and I think they'll slip out. Uh, one of these LEDs on this other camera behind me is not working, but again, you really don't use it, and I don't know if you can interchange them, but I don't use those LEDs anyway. The issue was I couldn't get it to focus, so... And then a smaller, fine one takes off four screws off the top here. So this is pretty cool. Let's look under here. Just some normal standard wiring. And this is encapsulated. And there's some wiring going in which probably the LED and then the output for the camera. So it's pretty sealed and it doesn't look like I'm corroded or got water in there. So then they seal that with some kind of goop down there. So that looks kosher. And uh that absorbent thing would be discolored or something if I had a leak. So there's four screws on the back of this. Pretty cool design, not what I expected. I thought it was all one, and then the reason why it freaked me out was there was a hole right there, and there was water draining out, and I'm like, oh, did a grommet or something? But I use these pretty gingerly, so... I was wondering why it wasn't focusing and it ruined my day. So I'm just going to take a lens cloth, clean that off. So there's really no function to taking this apart because you can pretty much get to the whole lens. when it's together in its fashion. I believe this is one of the ones that have the LED lights out, but I don't use an LED, the LED lights on this unit because uh, those little microbes highlight and you lose a little bit of a depth of view. Oh, there's some boogers on there that's not coming off. Which is weird because this is more. Oh well. So this one actually works. I try to alternate, and I don't. The sled right out is the bumpiest it gets. But that's pretty cool. So the LED lights look like they're running parallel, or whatever that is. They're bridged. So I think you could take those out and replace them, but I think it'd be a pain in the butt. Yeah, those are sealed in there. So let's put that back in. Yeah, I don't know what the issue is. I was just worried that there was a O-ring or something in here. I guess the extra weight gets the water in there and makes it helps it sink. So that looks good. Snug that in there real quick. Yeah, so I don't know what its issue is. Maybe just a dirty lens. Or there was a green light. And that could have caused it not to focus. But never had an issue with it. You know, just... And then when I went vertical, it cleared right up. So, glad to see there's no water. Usually general rule, snug, and then just a twitch after. Yeah, those don't grip too hard. It feels like it's already slipping. 
So just nice and easy. It looks like soft aluminum. But that's basically what's in your Vexilar camera. And I think if you break it or do something, if this gets water in there, they just send you a whole new unit or you would probably just buy a new camera. Because to break that down and get to the electronics and it looks like they dumped something in there. Yeah, I don't see no issues with it. Let's see if I can gently put her back together. Yeah, the only thing you have to watch out for is those tabs. Came a little loose. Hmm. Well, clean the lens. I hopefully it was just a minor malfunction. But seems to be pretty sealed and We'll rule that out. Uh, next coming video is uh, something with the Wi-Fi I'm having issues with. No! Well, this is just me putting it back together. Uh, Captain Salazar, I think was... And someone else chimed in or popped up in the subscribers. Welcome. Probably going to unsubscribe after this video. But yeah. Hmm. So I thought something was wrong because this was leaking out water. And I thought the water got in here and this was just O-rings and whatnot. But it could have been a dirty lens that wasn't causing it to focus. Man, it just looked like opening your water under heavy chlorinated thing and you could just barely make out an outline. So then I had to try the vertical look and I wasn't too happy with it. Well, Uncle L's out. 